Today I will show you how to make this brain rot pixelated effect. Yo, it's Povikas here and let's begin. Alright guys, so the first thing we want to do is press Ctrl to Y to make a new adjustment layer. And now we can start adding effects. So the first effect we can add is glow. The glow effect damages the look a bit more. So I'm gonna set it to 75.3 and I'm gonna make the glow radius to 116, the glow intensity to 0.3. Now let's add unsharp mask, add it on top of glow and let's make the amount to 120 and the radius to 2. And another very important thing you need to do is go here to the resolution and switch it from full to half. And sometimes even third is really good, but here let's just have it half. Uh, now let's add huge saturation. Oh, I think it's stuck like this, yeah, huge saturation. Uh, I like to make the master saturation here just lower, so like minus 34, or though you can change it to whatever you want. I just kind of like it like this. And now let's add mosaic. Let's make the horizontal blocks here to 350 and also 350 on the vertical blocks. Now it's already pixelated and it's a pretty cool look and now let's add maybe the most important effect as jpeg damage and let's add it on top of mosaic here we have this really pixelated look and the only thing i like to actually change here is the y frex scale to 2.2 now this kind of makes it like look like a meme almost but this is the look they sometimes have in the music video sometimes they actually make the quality even worse like this but let's just have it to 0.1 and this is how it looks on osama Sun. and what we can do actually is go to one of the effects press ctrl a to select every effect now go to animation save animation preset and let's save this as a preset so we can call it like brain rot pixelated effect press save and now whenever you want to have this effect on your video you will just be able to go to effects and presets type brain rot pixelated effect and just drag it and drop it now keep in mind that we're using half quality so whenever you want to render it you'll actually have to select the borders like press b here and press n here for like just one clip because then it goes to another you would actually have to go to composition and add to render queue and here it's going to be important to go to best settings and make the resolution to half press ok and go to here and press on resize and now you can render it out and also guys i want to tell you about my povikas.com website in which i have packs like the, my flicker presets pack or my opium presets pack personally believe that the opium presets pack works very well with these type of looks so if you have my opium presets pack uh you can add opium too i actually have over 50 presets on this pack also like text presets and stuff we can add this like below i guess the layer and you would have this very dark damaged look, which is insane, I think. But anyways, guys, that's about it for the tutorial. If you have any questions, then please let me know. But anyways, it was fun. Have a fun and productive day. See ya.